this is Matthew Filipovich from Heads Up at Go Left TV, and welcome to The Week in Cartoons, where we gather an entire week's worth of Heads Up cartoons into one nice, convenient location. So what do we have in store for you this week? Well, this last weekend, Heads Up attended the National Conference for Media Reform in Minneapolis, Minnesota. While we were there, Bill O'Reilly actually sent one of his goons to try to ambush Bill Moyers, and honestly, Bill Moyers ripped him a new one. It was pretty awesome, so we have a cartoon about that. We have John McCain saying that it is not too important important when our troops come home from Iraq. We have Dennis Kucinich showing some spine and introducing 35 articles of impeachment against George W. Bush. Of course, the Democratic leadership is going to do nothing about it. We have Tommy Thompson, the former head of Health and Human Services, profiting off the toxic dust of 9-11. But we are going to kick things off with John McCain saying that he is the candidate of change. Even though this year he voted with George W. Bush 100% of the time. What are we waiting for, everybody? Let's watch some cartoons. And up. My friends, let me ask you, why does my opponent, Senator Obama, feel the need to keep mentioning my name along with the president's? The Bush-McCain policies, Bush-McCain, Bush-McCain, when he knows that's not true, why does he say that? Well, because, Senator, in 2008, you voted with President Bush 100% of the time. You're going to continue his war, his tax cuts for the wealthy, his horrible foreign policy. Okay, so it's true. That doesn't mean he has to say it. Dana, Tommy Thompson was Secretary of Health and Human Services following 9-11, where he was criticized for not doing enough to protect workers from the toxic dust after the attack. Well, now Thompson's company has been awarded an $11 million contract to monitor the poor health of some of the same workers that he neglected. Well, in America, we believe in second chances, and if you can make millions of dollars exploiting your second chance, well, what is more American than that? Speaker Pelosi, Dennis Kucinich introduced 35 articles of impeachment against President Bush. I know, it's so embarrassing. Dennis actually believes in the Constitution and the rule of law. We voted it to the Judiciary Committee where it'll die a silent and suffocating death. So don't you worry, Mr. President. The Democratic leadership has got your back. Keep on breaking those laws. Hell, bomb Iran if you want to. We won't do anything about it. Woot woot. Senator McCain, about your saying that it's not too important when American troops come home from Iraq? It's not, as long as we're not taking casualties. And when do you realistically think that's going to happen? Well, when it happens is not too important. And the fact that we're building permanent military bases in Iraq over the objections of the Iraqis? Well, obviously what the Iraqis think is not too important. And you plan to stop casualties with that strategy? Yeah, that's not too important either. Bill O'Reilly, now it's time for Da No Spin Zone. No Spin Zone, No Spin Zone. Da Looney's just held Da National Conference for Media Reform. They're dangerous and a threat. They're against a few corporations owning all Da Media. We'll have more when we come back on Da Factor. We're out. How's that, boss? Right, when we come back, I want you to attack Bill Moyers. Da, yes, master. We'll do it live. We'll do it live. We'll do it live.